step on the sidewalk, otherwise you're going to jail. Get Patty. on the sidewalk. Patty. You need to be quiet. Move. Tonight's top story caught on camera. Body camera video of the naked cowboy getting arrested at Bike Week. And tonight, the naked cowboy is talking to Fox 35 News. Good evening and welcome. I'm Luann Sorrell. Thanks for joining us, everybody. I'm Charles Belay. Fox 35, Samantha Sosa, live tonight, working on this story. Samantha. Well, the naked cowboy is a bike week lover, but he certainly was not happy that this happened. After this arrest, he says he's going to fight back. Hanging out in my county blues, dates on the beach, didn't want nothing to do with you. Robert Burke, a.k.a. Naked Cowboy, has already made a song about his latest trip to Daytona Beach that ended like this. Get Patty, on the sidewalk. Patty. You need to be quiet. Move. Get your <laughs> over here. Do not resist. You are fighting me. The strings of his famous guitar sticking out every which way after Daytona Beach officers arrested him for panhandling and also charged him for resisting arrest without violence. People try to give me money, but I'm not asking. No, we see them giving you money. I know, I know they do. You can't do that. They took me to the police station. That was after they put me in the cruiser and then in the tank, drove me in my underwear, got me there. They were still kind of very kind of pushy, even at the police station. Spent the night in jail, sitting there all by myself, scared. Uh, but whatever, it was good. I got out, I survived. Now we're down to Siesta Key. And hey, how you doing? He tells me he's never been in trouble in Daytona before. For 21 years, I've gone down there. I love it. I didn't even have my ID on me because I'm so, you know, not expecting any problems. A judge dismissed the panhandling charge, and the naked cowboy pled no contest to resisting arrest. Now he's planning to take legal action. We're actually filing a, you know, a civil lawsuit and everything. We're going to overturn the not guilty plea, and we're going to, you know, just basically loosen up laws. Again, if somebody's aggressively begging for money, I'm not for that either. But if someone comes to town and they're just having a good time entertaining people, people are enjoying them, then, you know, this is no time for that kind of, uh, you know, annoyance. Well, I asked Daytona Beach Police for comment on this potential lawsuit, and they say that they don't have any comment. As for the naked cowboy, he said he isn't letting this incident keep him away from Daytona. He said he'll be here on Friday. I'm live in Daytona Beach tonight. Samantha Sosa, Fox 35 News.